Okay, so here we go with the iPhone Remote app released today on the iPhone's App Store. It's free and it's from Apple themselves. Okay, run it. Uh, you see your phone appear on iTunes. Pop in the number that appears on your iPhone or your iPod Touch. Click OK and that's it. You're good to go. Okay, so you get to choose your tracks. It's the same as uh, if you were at your iPod. You've got album, artist, playlist, etc. The album art appears. Uh, the music here is coming directly from the computer, the iMac. The music isn't being produced by the iPhone. So as you can see, there's a, a tiny delay before the cover art appears. But uh, all in all, it's pretty good. And of course, as well as controlling all your music on iTunes, you can use your iPhone or your iPod Touch to control your Apple TV. So grab the update first of all, download the update and install that, and your Apple TV will reboot and uh, it will magically have the Apple remote facility. Um, pretty much just the same as iTunes this time, uh, into the remote setup here, there's the update software uh, menu item. But go into remotes this time, and feed in the number that appears on your iPhone. Um, that's just a, an easy way for linking the two devices. Done. So simple as that really. And now your iPhone is controlling your telly. There we go, that's a fantastic podcast that everyone should be watching. Um, you've got play, pause, skip back, skip forward. Kind of groovy. There you go. So if you haven't got an iPhone, what are you waiting for? Bottom, bottom.